Hey y'all, how's my Goo Goo's doing today? Hope everyone is doing well and I hope you guys had a wonderful weekend. In today's video, I will be making barbecue chicken thighs. I have about seven thighs here that I've already washed and trimmed. I have my barbecue rub here. This is just a little of all the seasons that I have in my cabinet. I have some liquid smoke here as well as some butter, okay? Give me one second, let me wash my hands and we'll get started. All right, let's get these thighs seasoned. So what I'm gonna do is just poke a few holes in it just like this here. And I'm gonna take some of this butter and season that I mixed up together and just rub that under the the skin just like this here because we want the chicken to be seasoned all the way through okay let me go in with my hand and get this up under that skin real good want your, your meat to be seasoned good now Put that under there just like that there. <clears throat> I should have let this butter sit out a little longer, but that's okay. It's going to melt up under there and those flavors are going to marry all together. Let me wash my hands right quick. Get this seasoned real good. And I towel pat it dry the meats, okay? You want to get it as dry as you can. This is brown sugar, crushed red pepper, paprika garlic powder, onion powder, salt, just a variety of seasons that I had in my cabinet. I'm just going to massage these seasonings into this meat. Want it to be seasoned all the way through in every bite. But I'm just trying to make sure that I get a good coat on here on the seasonings. Add a little bit more. I'm going to add just a little bit more up under that skin, okay? Just like that. Don't be afraid to season your food now. Now this smells good, y'all, and it ain't even cooked yet. And it's smelling real good. All righty, and that's it for the seasoning. I'm gonna let that sit a few minutes and wash my hands. Okay, I'm getting ready to make some coleslaw while we wait on the uh, chicken to go in the oven. I have one bag of coleslaw mix here that I've already washed. I'm getting ready to sprinkle some lemon juice on it. I have some Duke, Duke's light mayonnaise that I'm going to use. And some sugar that I'm going to put in here too, okay? Okay. 
start out like that first because if you put too much in you won't be able to take it out once you put it in okay so always just add a little by little as you need it but if you too, put too much you won't be able to take it out so i'm just going to continue to work this around until the mayonnaise gets deep down into the uh, coleslaw mix I just had a taste of me some barbecue chicken today and some uh, coleslaw. You know, and I'm probably going to make me some french fries too because I've been craving those too. I know it's not keto. So I'm probably going to make this today a cheat day for me. Just to satisfy my taste buds, you know. Okay, so I need to add some more uh, meal to this. So I'm going to get another spoon. You know, trying to eat healthy and low carb is pretty hard, but, you know, I've been doing the best I can. So, you know, every now and then... You need a little cheat day to satisfy yourself to keep you going. I don't want that in there. But as long as I don't do it too much, I'm okay. Look at me making a mess, y'all. I think that's about enough meal for me. Then I'm going to add a little sugar. And then we're going to let this sit in the refrigerator and come up to temp. Give me one second. That's the oven. I'm going to place the chicken thighs in there. I have the oven set for 400. And these going to cook for about 40 to 45 minutes. All right. All right. I'm back. The thighs are in there. I set a timer for 45 minutes. And then we'll go from there. But let's finish this coleslaw for right now. <clears throat> what do y'all put in y'all coleslaw? I don't like these big pieces. Take those out. Y'all like them big pieces? I don't like them big pieces like that. Put some sugar in here. Mix this up real well and then I'm going to taste it and see if I need to add anything else. I had thought about breaking out the barbecue grill, but I was like, no, nah, not for that little bit. Bring out the grill. I want some ribs and everything else on that corn on the cob, baked potatoes and stuff. All right, so let's taste it. Let me see if we need anything. Needs a little bit more sugar. Uh oh, that was my refrigerator, you guys. Left it open. another bowl and let this get cold while we waiting on the uh, chicken all right yeah I put my coleslaw in another bowl so I'm just gonna sprinkle a little paprika on top to make it look pretty
and that's it and we're just gonna let this sit in the refrigerator and get cold while we're waiting on the chicken to get done and i'm gonna wipe off my seasoning you know make sure when you're dealing with any raw chicken or anything you make sure you wipe off everything that that you touch while you was messing with that chicken okay but i'll be back once the chicken is done all right y'all the thighs are done All right, y'all, here's the chicken. It turned out nice. I want to say thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And as you exit, hit that bell button so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. And please consider subscribing to the channel. Till the next time, bye.